even if we stopped burning fossil fuels today, greenhouse gas emissions from food and farming could make a climate catastrophe unavoidable. Expected increases in greenhouse gas emissions from farming, especially those caused by clearing and fertilizing land to grow crops, and those generated by farm animals and their manure, make it unlikely we will be able to keep global warming below 2 degrees Celsius. And even as transportation and energy emissions that contribute to the climate crisis are going down, emissions from agriculture are increasing. Plowing up grasslands and burning forests to cultivate the land for agriculture unlocks carbon from soil, sending it into the atmosphere as carbon dioxide. Fertilizing the crops we grow for animal feed and ethanol produces nitrous oxide, a greenhouse gas 300 times more powerful than carbon dioxide. Farm animals eat this feed and produce manure, generating methane emissions. Cows also produce methane, a greenhouse gas 80 times more powerful than carbon dioxide, or CO2. The EPA estimates that U.S. agriculture accounts for about 10% of our greenhouse gas emissions. As emissions from energy and transportation continue to fall in response to new policies, and emissions from fertilizer and animals grow due to rising demand for animal protein, agriculture's contribution to the climate crisis steadily increases. By 2050, greenhouse gas emissions from animals and the production of their feed could easily account for one-third of U.S. emissions. Right now, if America's meat and dairy industry were a country, it would be the 12th largest emitter of greenhouse gases. That's more than all of the greenhouse gas emissions from Canada. Now, if demand for protein doubles, as some predict, and all of that new demand is met by animal protein, meat's carbon footprint will get even bigger. The good news is that demand for plant-based proteins is growing, especially among consumers who are not vegetarians or vegan. More meat eaters are occasionally choosing fish and plant proteins which can help reduce greenhouse gas emissions.